Hello everyone. Welcome to BTNX Learning. In today's session, let's see as how Formula Bot, the AI tool, can help Excel users to generate formulas based on the project requirements. And also, let's see as how Formula Bot can break down the formula with the record information so that the user can understand the formula easily. Like uh, imagine when we are opening the Excel sheet, you will be seeing a lot of columns and a lot of rows and uh, every cell has a formula, right? If you go to that formula bar, we will come to know like we look up and we will come to know uh, many uh, formulas clubbed together. So by looking at the formula, it will be difficult for a person other than the uh, Excel uh, user or the person who created that formula, it will be very difficult for the other persons to understand what is the formula. Okay, because if I have worked on an Excel sheet, I will know what is that formula because I have worked on it. For example, if I am giving that Excel sheet to others and he um, to another person and he is looking at the formula, it will be very difficult for him to understand what this formula unless he works it. Means it takes a lot of time. So this formula bot can break down the formula with the record information so that the users can understand the formula easily. Okay, so why this formula bot, the Excel formula bot is a, a peculiar or why it is a treasure means it is AI powered one. Okay, AI powered in the sense everyone will know. Okay, because it uses artificial intelligence to understand your needs and generate the right formula for the task. Because nowadays everywhere, all systems and all programs, they are using all AI concepts or AI tools so that the developer's life will be easy. Okay. And the second point is like it is uh, uh, easy to use. Okay. Because imagine in whatever I am going to explain you with a demo, we will be just type our questions or the formula need. And the formula but will provide the answer to the solution answer with the solution okay so whatever the queries we have or whatever the problems we have this is very easy just like a uh, ordinary uh, student how he is uh, typing the keyboard like that we can give our instruction and we will get the result that is one of the uh, key feature and the third point is it is comprehensive okay why we are saying it is comprehensive because this formula, this Excel formula bot covers a wide range of Excel formulas from the basic to the advanced. Okay, so that is, so the main three features are, it is AA powered, wherever the tools, where the AA powered uh, features are there, it is an added advantage. The second thing is, it is easy to use. And the third part is, it is comprehensive. Like that, there are many things. And what are the benefits over here? The benefits are, uh, like, uh, uh, it saves your time, so that you may not get frustration because like uh, uh, drafting a formula is very difficult. We may make some small errors, right? For example, when you're creating a VLOOK, VLOOKUP or when we are creating some Excel formula, there may be chance we may omit a colon, we may omit a small quote, we may uh, miss some parentheses. At that time, it will create an issue, okay? And this helps you to learn how to use the Excel formulas. And like it improves your productivity and accuracy because like definitely when it is giving you all the formulas, when it is explaining you what is the formula present in it. So obviously you will save the time, right? Your productivity will be more and the result also will be accuracy. Okay. And the, uh, the chance of uh, uh, increasing the errors are less. Overall, it will reduce the risk of the errors. And Finally, what it will do, it makes Excel more accessible to users of all skill levels. Okay, anyone can use like that. Uh, it will give the solution. So these are the features. Okay, so now let's enter into the uh, demo. Like, okay, so if you, this is the sample uh, thing I have uh, created actually. It has a branch name, period, amount. Okay, so before that, okay. So Excel formula bot, it can be done in two ways. Now I will explain you how with the help of plugin, you can add that uh, uh, Excel formula bot in the uh, Excel ribbon, like uh, add in, that means you will get it over here. You can see the, I am pointing it over here, right? Show formula bot. So how we can install it, I will uh, let you know. 
okay so if you go to the excel go to the home okay guys and go to the home page you will see add-ins okay click that add-ins okay so since i have already installed this formula but so i'm not going to install it again but i can explain you you can go to this get uh, get add-ins okay so in this get add-ins you will see lot of uh, uh, features like uh, go from go to the search button and put formula but and uh, press it enter okay so you need to add this thing once you add it will come over here okay once you once this uh, show formula but has come over here it will ask you the credentials okay because i have already signed in it will ask you the credentials you need to uh, use your uh, uh, email id password you need to set you need to sign up it has uh, for um, um, monthly it is giving you five chances uh, as a free okay and after that you may need to pay so you can uh, choose uh, whichever option you want okay so once you sign in and once you enter all the details you will get into it so there are two features over here let's see one is generate formula another is explain formula generate formula is here and another thing is explain formula okay so now let me go into the demo part see for example imagine there is a, a company okay in the in any company or firm or any uh, sectors there will be different branches okay i have telecom i have banking logistics admin okay these are the branches and these are the employees person like jack mark so and so people over here this is the period okay uh, this is march june time and this is the amount let's say this is as a profit okay so uh, let, uh, let's make this as a profit so imagine if i am a ceo or if i am a owner of a company first i will think what was the what was the revenue for the year or what was the revenue for the month every month i will look what is the profit right i won't look at the eat each and any, every individual how much he contributed of course i will look but my main concentration will be of what is what was my early profit and which branch on uh, this month or for example for march month for the uh, branch of telecom how much revenue as a team or as a uh, uh, department they have delivered so what it will happen this is on march telecom branch period of march is there any other telecom branch for the period of march yes in this thing there is a telecom and march okay so what will i will do i need to add this and this part so that i will come to know what is the total uh, revenue generated for the month of march for the branch telecom similarly for banking okay for, for the banking, the, the person Vijay in the month of August has generated 7,896.23. And similarly, this banking, okay, uh, the person Raj for the month of August. So here also banking, here also banking. This is also month of August. This is also month of August. He has generated. So as a, uh, as a CEO or as a company owner, I would need to find for example for the branch of telecom okay and for the duration of march what will be the my uh, total okay so for that that means from the answer must be it has to add this and this okay so for that the formula what will be the formula is it will be like uh, since i have uh, uh, done, i am just show you okay i'm going to this formula okay here is the place okay where we need to submit actually okay so i'm going over here i'm typing here see i'm mentioning sum okay sum this is the part d column right so sum column d okay this test to sum column of all the d if column a okay if column a equals to h7 so h is here and 7 is here okay here yes, uh, 7 is here equals and the period okay what is the duration here i am mentioning march this and the 
C colon, that means the column C, the March period, it has to add. What I am doing for the branch of overall, if I want to say, for the telecom branch, for the month of March, what is the total? For that, is this is the uh, uh, formula. Okay. So, like uh, sum column D, this is the column D. I am summing up the column D. If column A, okay, if the column, that means the branch, equals to cell H7, this is the cell H7, okay, and the column C, this is the column C, anywhere else where there is uh, equals to March, then it has to sum, okay, I am giving the submit button, okay, so this is the value, this is the formula, okay. So that you can copy like this or you can directly you can insert over here. Okay. So if I press over here for the month of tele the for the telecom branch, these two things for March period, if we add 2343 plus 67 and 98567.23, you will get this amount. Okay. So as a CEO or as a product uh, uh, owner or a company owner, I can easily get the uh, result like this. Instead of uh, uh, drafting the formulas, instead of memorizing all the formulas, it's how easy I just gave the small info it gave to me. So similarly, what we can do, banking. Okay, let's see for banking. Here also banking is here. This is the person Vijay for the month of August. The, here there is banking and it is August, okay? The person is Raj. Well, let's put banking, okay? A-I-N-G, banking, and the month of August. Okay, so automatically, it has added this amount, banking, and this amount, 7896.23 plus 9878.23, and it gave this result. And uh, like uh, banking has done, telecom has done. And uh, uh, for example, if you, the uh, uh, admin and logistics are only one, let's see, put logistics for the month of March. So it has added. Let's make, for example, there is logistics. Imagine, is there anything January? Imagine, let's keep a month which is not present, okay, which is not applicable to logistics because there is only one branch and there is no, apart from March, there are no other months for logistics. I am making it January, okay? Okay, let's see what, what result is I'm getting. So, zero. Okay, guys. So, now you come to know how it's so easy, okay? It's just you are giving the... Uh, uh, what to say the parameters over here and then after that you can like if you want to add further thing you can just with the help of this uh, double click you can get all the result you are drafting one formula over here and you are getting all the details so this is the peculiarity of excel formula bot so even you can try with the different uh, uh, values and you can explore you can make your hands dirt by exploring various uh, methods so that you will come to uh, you will come to know and you also will be familiar like uh, this is j just a basic uh, idea of uh, summation i have given you can try uh, different things and you can explore it and i hope you enjoyed this uh, video and i hope you liked it uh, thank you guys see you again bye bye